with our national anthem here tonight. 10,000 plus. Johnny, this is the atmosphere here tonight. You can really jumpstart the Tigers on here. No, I mean, pretty something, something I wasn't used to, that's for sure, coming from Iowa for the past three years and before that prep school in a small town in Connecticut came out here and 18,000 people at the school or something and everyone loves hockey and you can just sense how rich the tradition of hockey is since we stepped on campus. I saw all those banners on the wall and I thought you know they had a good program they had a winning team obviously um, also, they had a nice picture of what they thought the policy center was going to be like. And I, got, I was really impressed with the facility. I was really excited to move in and play in this new rink. I remember my freshman year, we lost to Holy Cross in game three of the playoffs. And I uh, said goodbye to the seniors that year as a freshman. And you know, everybody gave a hug and they said, enjoy the time while it lasts because it goes by quick. My first thought was, man, it's I got a lot of time left here, but the honest truth is it does go by really fast. Four years has gone by and it's been a great ride and I wouldn't have traded it for the world. Guys that I'll never forget, and, uh, friendships that will last a lifetime and uh, you know, winning championship uh, with my class and uh, other classes as well. I think that'll stick with me, you know, championship teams and uh, championships walk together forever. I'd have to, there's been a lot of, you know, memorable games. I mean, obviously the two championship games are, will always be important to me. Uh, I'd have to say, one that really sticks out to me is my freshman year, maybe scoring my first goal in the Ritter. Um, it's a pretty special experience and it's fun with a lot of family and friends. So that was something that kind of was really looking forward to growing up and being able to have that experience and accomplish it was pretty, pretty neat. I actually have the chills right now actually thinking about it, but uh, you know, it's, it's just another game. Um, you know, I'm sure once it's all done and said, there might be a few tears and you know, it'll be a bittersweet ending, but I think you know, going into it, it's just another game and another opportunity to put what I have on the line and you know, like our slogan is die on empty, you know, die on empty for senior, senior year. Every, every home game, every even away game, you know, uh, the stands are going to be packed with our fans. I think they're probably the best fans in the league in all of college hockey. Um, I mean, it's just it's impossible not to get excited to, uh, to play in front of them. Um, you know, to go to a Division One school where you're not overshadowed by a big uh, basketball or uh, football Division One team, where you're kind of the, the team, um, definitely makes it that much more exciting. I just like to thank the fans uh, here at RIT for the past four years. You know the pep band, the corner crew. You know the best fans in the land. Uh, you know they've been uh, really good friends to me here, and I just can't thank them enough for all the support and love they've given me through these four years. Not only RIT, and the students here, and the faculty, coaches, teammates, but you know Rochester, the, the city of Rochester, New York as well.